This is the K-State Collegian Paracat Post Game Show. I'm John Zetmeyer here with Spencer Lau, and we're here at Bill Snyder Family Stadium where the K-State Wildcats just won in incredible fashion over the TCU Horned Frogs 33-31. It wasn't easy for the Wildcats as it took sophomore Jack Cantelli to step up and hit a 41-yard field goal with three seconds left on the clock to give K-State that elusive sixth win to make them bowl eligible. Here's Jack's thoughts after the game. Uh, there was no doubt that it was going in. Uh, it was one of my best kicks I've ever kicked, you know, going right down the middle the whole way. I just, I really didn't know how to react. I was just so pumped. Uh, All right, Spencer, early on in the season, we saw K-State lose games in these kind of situations. Oklahoma State, Baylor, Texas had opportunities late in the game but couldn't get it done. What was the difference tonight for the Wildcats? Uh, John, I'd say there were two real big differences. The first one, kind of the easy one to say, Jack Cantelli, four for four on field goals, that clutch, clutch, late time goal. Um, you got to love kickers that can do that. They're either the hero or they're the joker. Today he was definitely the hero. The second big key is the two quarterback systems seem to work pretty well today. Daniel Sams over 100 yards rushing, um, Jake Waters over 200 yards passing. They both seem pretty, pretty fluid coming in and out of the game, so that was impressive to me. And one of the biggest differences, kind of what you said, with the two quarterbacks, in these kind of situations early on in the season, we saw turnovers, we saw Jake Waters fumbling against Texas, we saw interceptions against Oklahoma State and Baylor from both him and Sams. So it, it really, that really was probably one of the biggest differences today. Absolutely. Now going forward, the Wildcats were 2-4 and four at one point, and now they're 6-4 and four with a big game next weekend against Oklahoma. Just thoughts on that one. Uh, Oklahoma game is huge. It's kind of kind of be if it's a win, it's a big statement win for win for any bowl game we might go to. Well, we will be going to. Uh, if it's a loss, they can rebound from it and still pull out a pretty good season. So it is definitely important. Oklahoma's a great team. Yeah, indeed. And Oklahoma's always been tough. Got the win last year, but before last year, hadn't beat them since 2003. And that'll wrap us up from from Bill Snyder Family Stadium. I'm John Zetmeyer with Spencer Lowe. Tune in later this week as we'll bring you the Powercat Preview Show.